Joe Cracknell, thanks for coming out to join us. Uh, a really tough game for Middlesex, an enormous bundle of runs scored there today, but I guess sometimes you just have to take your hats off to the opponents who batted superbly. Yeah, look, um, a good wicket. We played on it on Tuesday. We knew it was going to be high, high scoring. Um, and some of the striking at the end there was phenomenal. When someone gets 100 off 35, 40 balls, sometimes you've got to say, well done and, and fair play. And no matter if it was a, forget it was an outground, if it was a, a, a big stadium, they'd be going well over the rope as well. So look, again, another, another tough one. But as I said, some of, their, some of the striking was very good. I mean, the spotlight falls on the bowlers there at the end. I think they hit 72 off the last three overs, but it didn't really seem to matter what you bowled at Cook at the end there and Ingram. Everything went, slower balls, Yorkers. They were just putting everything over the rope. Yeah, and, that, and that's what we say as a, as a bowling unit. Have a have a, have a have um, an A plan, a B plan and a C plan. If And if all three of those aren't working, then look, I'm not a bowler, but I, I can imagine it's a pop quite a difficult place to be in um, and as I said yeah some of the, some of those those strikes were, were off our best balls and you can't do much about that yeah, absolutely uh, in terms of our run chase we put up a pretty damn good show of it um, yourself and Eski putting on 150 odd for the first wicket both going at a strike rate of 200 odds not too much more chasing 12 and over that you guys could have done at the top end yeah exactly look we we're pretty pleased with, with how we went about it. we always said look, nothing to lose and, and, and play without any fear and I think at 11 or 12 overs, we were right in amongst it. Um, but as soon as you, as soon as you're chasing a total like 240, you have to be inch perfect. And if we lost, uh, Eski and myself uh, went in within the space of two overs, and for the guys coming in, it can be quite difficult to um, hit the boundary and hit, hit sixes from the first ball. So, as I said, when we're chasing a big total like that, you have to be inch perfect. And, and unfortunately, we we weren't quite there. Joe, four losses from the opening four games. It doesn't get any easier. We're down to the West Country for two tough games in the next few days. Um, how do you bounce back from this? It's one of those we like in in the four games we played. We've had some really really good periods. Um, the last game we, we played really well for 38 overs of it. Um, today we were we were really good with with the bat and and in the power play as well. I think there were only 45 or something. So like yeah. there have been some really really good moments. It's just now about. Taking those positives and 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 putting that into a into a 40 over performance rather than the 20, 30, 35 over performance that we've we've had um, in the last four games. Yeah, for sure. Do you feel you're making progress as a side? I mean, on any other day you hit 210 chasing in innings, but you hit 210 and you're winning most games. Yeah, well, absolutely. And I think they even showed in the first game that against Surrey we're right up the rate and we're we're happy to go about it that way. Um, and if and if we fall, have many short but going up at the rate, then then that's a positive. Um, so look, what we're trying to do isn't going to happen overnight, and we know that as players, we know that, but as staff, but like the backing and the belief is definitely there in amongst the change room. It's just <laughs> get that first win, and, and look, you never know in T20 cricket you can go on a run. So as I said, yeah, it's not going to change overnight, but it's one of those we we, we keep going. Yeah, that's good to hear. Well, mate, you've played your part today, really well batted. Shame we couldn't get over the line, but uh, good luck down in the West Country. Thanks very much. Cheers, guys.